Hi guys, we are continuing with the day 7 uh, assignments from InfiTQ module 1 Programming Fundamentals with Python. In this problem, we have to write a function in order to implement a biased coin toss. What does a fair coin toss do? We have in a fair coin toss, we have an equal choice of chance of getting head or tail that is 50 percent but in a biased coin toss it is not 50 percent and we have to write a program where we are getting head 70 percent of the time that is if we invoke the program thousand times approximately 700 times we must get a head so what we would be doing here we would be using the random module okay in the random module we have a function called random which generates a, a value from one to uh, from in a particular given range so we would be generating from 1 to 100 and if the value is less than 700 we would 70 we would be generating uh, we would be uh, returning head that is 70 percent of the time we, uh, the random would uh, obviously since the range is given from 1 to 100 70 percent of the time we uh, the random function almost 70 percent of the time the random function would generate a number that is between 1 and 70 right other otherwise uh, the rest of the 30 percent times it would be generating the number from uh, greater than 70 so what we are doing if it is less than a probability we would be returning head that is 70 uh, we are getting an approximate probability of 70 percent for heads and otherwise we would be returning tail the, that is 30 percent approximately so and then uh, this would be a this would be a bias toss then we would be also creating a function that would be uh, there where we would be providing the number of flips and we would be getting the number of heads and tails. Let's jump into our PyCharm and let's just start coding this particular program. As we are coding, we would be getting a better understanding of how this particular program works. So let's go to D7 and create a new Python file as, sorry, let's create a new Python file as problem 30. Sorry guys, that is, I pressed a wrong key, so problem 36, so first just let us import the random module and let's create a function as biased underscore toss. The biased underscore toss function takes in the probability and if random dot random that is any number generated between 1 and 100 is less than probability then we would be returning head otherwise we would be returning tail okay so this is a bias underscore toss and now we have to count the number of heads and our tails for a particular number of flips and the probability given okay so def count suppose, suppose it takes in parameter as flips the number of flips that is required and the probability so we are initializing the heads as 0 and tails as 0 for i in range flips if biased underscore toss uh, we are passing the probability that we are taking as a second parameter if it is uh, if, if it is equal to equal to head then we would be adding it to head we would be increasing the number of heads by one else we would be increasing the value of tails by one and we would be returning heads and tails as the function uh, return values let's just print our count so what does count do in count you specify the number of flips for example in the function in the problem it was asked to uh, invoke the problem a program a thousand times so the number of flips would be thousand and here also you provide the probability 
that is uh, how biased the coin would exactly be so if you are providing 50 the coin would be unbiased and if you are providing 70 the number of heads the probability is basically for the number of heads okay uh, it's basically for the probability of getting heads that is if you are providing 70 that is 70 percent of the time you would be getting heads okay so let's just print count and let's just provide 1000 and the probability as well as 70 let's run our code so we are getting 721 and 279 which is close to 700 but not that close 676 and 324 701 and 299 uh, 706 and 294 so as you can see we are always getting an approximate value that is lying around 700 that is for tossing the coins a uh, thousand times we are getting an approximate of 700 uh, 700 number of heads okay so that's it for the video guys i hope so you understood how to use random in order to create a bias toss uh, function and if you have not understood i would highly recommend you to watch the video again so thanks for watching this video guys see you in the next one